Criminal charge for it echoes our left base runway 20 watch the touch and go. You got me? Got you. Now, if I'm cutting out, so break it up like this a little bit. Well, uh, adjust that. All right. All right. Now, here's you and me inside the cockpit, arm volume. So uh -huh. you can turn me way up, turn me off. So right. adjust it so it's comfy. Now, with your uh, left hand, probably, you can pull that uh, static out and adjust the volume control um, on your COM 1. Okay, good. Flip up COM 2 and listen as we're warming up to the little man. Here's a volume for him. We're just listening as we're warming up. Temperature 1.6 Celsius. So you can look up here at 1.6. Altimeter 3015. So I'm going to adjust the altitude 0. Boom. Watsonville Municipal Airport, Let's get the Watsonville, wind. California. Automated weather observation, 1808 Zulu. Wind 310 at 04. Right Visibility behind us, 4, four knots. Zero. Sky condition okay. broken Okay, click it to neutral. Now, um, this is already, it says, it's got this message light, so hit the message light, and it says, it's going to say ready for nav, so hit the nav button. And then you want to go to the nearest airport, which is us. So hit nearest, and it'll say Airport Watsonville. Right. Let's go direct to it. Is that what you want? Okay, hit enter, and boom. There it is. And then with a the big knob, I think you click it to yourself toward one click, and that'll give you a little page. This is our distance. Yeah, 0 0.13, uh, ground speed, heading, etc. It's hard to see, but that's all you got. What is five down here? Five is the... the the, the scale of this little map, uh, and you can go with this, with a little knob, you can go way out into space, like here is a 120 nautical mile scale, and you can see what airports are coming up, San Jose, whatever. Uh, we don't need it. So we'll go all the way down, see, see all the airports in oh, the wow. area? We'll Port go down technology. to five. <laughs> all right, you're green now, so why don't we do a magneto check at 75, no more than 7%, two seconds. You have to have some kind of drop, so make sure it does drop on you. No, no drop at all. How come? Let's see. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, back to full. That's good. I get it all we'll go. Boom, boom. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, back to full. That's good. Make sure it's a good click, not shove. All right, spray clutch check. Crack off the needle. Beep. Good. What about your door? Latch? Door. All Latch. right. Now, with what was it, 16 degrees? What did you say? 25. 25, 23, 4. Yep. All right. So friction, friction. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. A little warm in here. I think we'll cool off. All right. Oh. Now, come on the controls. Both feet on the pedals. And gently roll it up to 80. Let the governor kick in. Boom. Clutch light should kind of come on and readjust the belt, which it's doing, see? The weight. 
Right. Now you're going to check your light and your horn. Make sure it works. So a little gentle because we have a lot of power. Good, good, good. Boom. Now don't pick it up yet. I want you to be real happy with everything here. So the yeah. compass is uh, free swinging and looking good. There's no greasy stuff hanging down. Boom. So give it a full look. There's one thing I'd like you to have done on here. So see if you know what, if you can read my mind. Carpet's good. We're on the freak. Coming down, coming down. So it's a swing all the way down. Now you're here and aha, uh -huh. that's what I like. Landing light on. Because right. we want to be seen, all right? Yeah. Carpe, do I... I? I'd leave it because as you raise it, it'll go down by itself. It's sort of that gauge, that type of gauge. So yeah. let's keep it up. All, all right, right, you're clear left. Clear uh, in front. Right. Just got the guy. Clear there. right. We got a little moisture on the screen here. Two all stage. Right. This is called a two stager, right? Two stage pickup. First stage is light. When you get light, you stop the pull and you fix the movement with pedals and attitude. You're uh, reach about well, you're, pull, you're lifting, so think left. Anticipate the need for left pedal as you're lifting. All right, there's 18, so your eyes are outside. Nineteen. All right, there it is. So fine tune it. Main tank is on the left, so you're gonna be left skid low. So you fix that as you're coming up. Left skid. That's a little aft. Don't punch anybody. Fix this. Fix this with pedals. Height. No wind really. It's only four knots behind you. So that was a little aggressive. I get control of your aircraft. See, I'll let you fix it. So that's good. Look around and let's walk out to the taxiway. I could have fixed that, but I didn't want to. I wanted you to do it. Center line. I don't like that sign. All right, walk with me down the taxiway as you're warming up with a tailwind, I think. We're going to go down this way. Left base touch and go. Let's see if we can find them. Wow, look, we got moisture coming in, huh? There he is. So we got a, a, a mower way down there. Don't run down there. Stay always center line. Think center line. Straddling the center line. Five feet. Uh, car, Pete's good. It did go down a little bit. Don't run. Pretty poor radio. If you run too fast, the 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 helicopter is going to think it's going to take off, and you're going to fly. So you want to stay nice and walk, heading with pedals. Good. This guy said touch and go. A good walking pace, or uh... this is a brisk walk. So that's good. The mower is cutting a lot of grass, so over the grass is going to be a lot of uh, this. So, all right, up here I want you to uh, face something. Wind, oh, yeah. wind is four knots out of three three zero or somewhere. So why don't you come up here and turn into the wind somewhere up here where okay. you're comfortable, and we're going to land. All right, okay. I want you to try that pickup again. That was a little sloppy. Yeah. So clear your tail. There's nobody coming out. Car over there. All right. Now you got to look at something. I don't care what you look at, but look at something. Right. And get real stable and then breathe the thing down to the ground. So we're going to land out here somewhere. Look how nice this is. A little movement there. you got to be uh, no movement at all. So relax your right hand. Watsonville traffic, right. airport ground vehicle entering Niner 27. Going to exit. Taxiway Alpha into Niner 27. Watson. Beautiful. That was great. That's him talking to you, but so what? All right, nobody on your left. Nobody's on base leg, I think. Yeah, there's a guy on base up there. Yeah, no factor. So anybody behind you coming? Sometimes they sneak up behind us. Yeah, 
so. Back there. Now let's do a better pickup because that one was too adios. You know, I want a nice, smooth, mellow two stager. It came after that you kind of randied it up. For maintenance crew doing maintenance on runway nine or two seven. All right, good. Everyone in the pattern, please be advised. Watsonville. So you kind of kind of remember where the first stage was. So you kind of get there. And taxi northbound on taxiway Alpha towards two zero. No factor yet. Guy's got a little crab on on his. All right, there's eight. Plus, and you know it's about to happen, so really concentrate here. Look outside, get real refined. Fix that right movement. That's a better pickup, huh? Now come up to five, do a little left, nobody's there, do a left turn, and check out this red aircraft that's coming at us. Five feet. Pivot. I want you to look at this guy coming. See him? Yep. All right. Why don't you come out here? Then we can turn here, Romeo, if you guys want. Take a look at the, the approach. There was some, some guy said base. Anybody on final? No. See anybody. Let's take the runway and kind of expedite left traffic to zero, all right? As you're, as you're expediting, you're doing your call. Lots of traffic, right. yeah. On the go, to, On the go zero. to zero, left traffic. Use your trim strings. Good, good. Good, look long. Grab. traffic, red test. That's crossing 927 on the ground. Got to look long so you don't do this. this. Yeah. All right, now that you're stable, make your call. On the go. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero Sierra Hotel. On the go, uh, two zero, left traffic, Watsonville. Got your numbers, let's do the climb up. There's a crosswind guy, see him? No, we're not gonna cut him off. Let's stay on his tail, all right? Don't all right. go in front of him. Any birds? Generally around four plus, 500, we'll do a left crosswind two zero Watsonville. All right. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero Sierra Hotel, left crosswind two zero Watsonville. Perfect. Anybody behind him coming in? It's the guy you don't see that's gonna mess with you. We got him, so don't fixate on him. Make sure you got it all clear. Now come back to your altitude that you want. Get ready for your fixing. That's the traffic red test. That's point two zero straight up departure to the south. Watsonville. Watsonville traffic helicopter zero zero hotel. Left downwind two zero Watsonville. Generally, you don't want to fly over kids. So a little wider. A little wider over schools and whatnot. There's your good altitude. So we'll just follow him. Watsonville traffic, airport ground maintenance crew on taxiway Alpha, intersecting with 927, doing maintenance work, Watsonville. That's him. So we're not going to bother him, all right? All they right. could have uh, junk laying around. So you got to pick a spot that you want to land on, not overflying the maintenance guy. And not bothering him if he's on the taxiway. So you already figured out where you're going to go. Don't ask me. All right. Come inside and get your normal numbers for your departure or descent. Okay, one, two. We got one, two. All right. Yep. Plus we have rain and a bird, so you got all kinds of stuff going on. But you're still climbing a little bit. Let's get down with the power setting and an attitude. There it is. Perfect. Let's follow him around. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel, left base two zero, Watsonville. All right, take a look at your angle from out here. You're looking really good. Find where you want to go, I don't care. Just don't get to the maintenance boys, because they don't like us blowing stuff around. 
I don't know if anybody's full stop, so we'll eyeball. All right. Taxiway parallel two zero is clear. So, yeah. so far, I don't know what this guy's up to. Anybody sneaking in? All right, get your numbers, your uh, altitude, your airspeed. Make it happen from right now. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel. Final for taxiway parallel two zero, Watsonville. Okay, look at your power too much, look at your airspeed too much. So work, 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 and don't climb. Don't be late. There's a dude down there, so don't overfly the dude. So kind of wide and boom. Still a little hot, 65. You should be 60 on base, 15 inches. Boom. So make it happen. There you go. The aft will slow you down. Down right aft. So look at this guy. He's taxiing off where you, right where you want to be. You're coming in like a rocket ship here. Let's uh, hit the brakes with down right aft. A little more right for trim. Bring in your power. That's a little rush. Now you're going to drop. There you go. You fixed it just in time. But don't yank the red line here. That was fair. That was a fair pattern. If that was a pinnacle, we may not have made the pinnacle. All right. Come down to five feet. And let's see what this Dustin is up to. How do you address somebody else on the... You talk to him. Say, uh, that's uh, Delta. See the D? That's uh, Cessna on Delta. What's your intentions? Cessna on Delta. What's your intentions? Uh, now we're putting him on the spot. First order, I was going to go into uh, United Flight Services. All right. Yeah. So we'll tell him we're going to sidestep to the grass, parallel 2-0, or something like that. We're going to sidestep to the grass, parallel 2-0. Don't overfly the cut grass. Try to find non-cut grass. All right. All right. You have control. Sidestep around this non-cut grass, and then around this over to that fresh area. So give it a little wider here, and a little over here, like that. So you're not blowing this stuff all over the place. All right. You got control. Look long. Just sit here for a second. Okay. Get him out of your way. And about five feet, so we don't blow too much grass around. Is that the thing with the freshly cut grass? You're just worried about blowing. Well, it'll it will ingest like it. We'll it. ingest it into our uh, into our air system. Yeah. It's not as good. So let's go grab the taxiway now. It's clear now. Make sure it's clear both ways as you're coming out. All right, let's come to a nice hover, five foot hover, and we'll look around, see who's in the pattern. Got a guy here. Let's see what else we got. Anybody on base? Anybody on base. final? Final. Okay, way. good, good, good. What about your gauges? How do they look? Heartbeats. Uh, it's good. good. Everybody's yep. happy. So now let's let's pick a spot. How about this uh, little intersection right here for your landing pad? All right. So let's check your gauges. Let's do another pattern, and you plan for this one. All right. Cool. Lights are out. Green. Carpet's good. Green. All right. Just a gentle walking pace. Transition, don't um, dolphin through the air. Now, see, that's yeah. to hit the brakes a little bit, a little mini quick stop like that. Just start walking slow all and right. heading with pedals, all right? Here comes that little transverse flow right about there. Perfect. Look at that. Don't look at the runway, look at the trees. Then quickly eyeball those numbers, and there we go. 22 and 60. Perfect. Now you're stable. Let everybody know what you're doing. Watsonville traffic, helicopter 0, zero hotel. On the go, taxiway parallel to 0, Watsonville. And we're going to make left traffic, so but that's all right. You'll get it on the crosswind. Inside out, oh, 2260. There it is. You're way ahead. You're thinking way ahead. Exiting runway 927 at taxiway Bravo, Watsonville. Look at the guy selling strawberries down there. You're already thinking what's next, what's next, what's next. Watsonville traffic, helicopter, zero, zero, hotel, left crosswind, two, zero, Watsonville. Watsonville traffic, 6-7, final runway, two, zero, full stop, Watsonville.
full stop. So he's going to be on your delta probably. You might have to add lib. We'll see. Right here. Looking good. This, that was a nice takeoff and that was a nice uh, crosswind. So let's let's be uh, on the numbers on your downwind basin final. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel. Left downwind, two zero, Watsonville. Good, you gave the kids a break. Check your altitude, you're perfect. So let's lean forward, relax your power. Take a deep breath, do your midfield checks. Also your spot. See, we'll see where he's going to exit. He said full stop. Which one's the uh, volume for the other traffic? Right here. Right there. Don't be descending too fast. Make sure you've got a spot to go to. And do your pre-landing checks. Lights are out, gauges green, carpet is. There it goes. But he's right on our delta, so you got to do something else. Runway. All right. If you're going to do something, be, be precise about it, all right? Yeah. Don't be uh, the whole runway. It's a big runway. Have a spot. When you turn base, look at your numbers, your power sending, your attitude, and get what you want. 65 on base, descending. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, Sierra Hotel, left base two zero, Watsonville. All right, take a peek at him. He's just okay. sitting there. So inside, outside. I don't think you're descending right now. You're kind of climbing, so a little baby input, so I don't notice. Down right pedal. Check the windsock, because that's your runway, actually. The uh, maintenance guys are gone. All right. He is actually gone as well. So Go runway here. Do your thing. You decided. You make your decision. Go get it. All right. Charlie by us, right? By us. Yeah. Watsonville traffic. Helicopter zero zero hotel. Final for two zero. Watsonville. I want 60, 20, and 15 inches. So gentle. Boom, 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 boom. A little more right. A little more down. A little more up. Level. Walking pace, 15. That's 16, show me 15 and a half. Yeah, this is too fast and we missed the numbers, but maybe you're aiming for something else. That's what you're gonna tell me. going for the next That's good, that's what you tell me. But make it happen, don't come running up here and do a quick stop. All right. Watsonville Unicom, Gamma Jet 889 is a blue and white King Air 350 taxiing from the FBO near the restaurant to runway 20 to hold short Watsonville. Delta. So don't let the, the pedals get away from you. Old level. There you go, yeah. That was nice. This is, you tell me, this is where I wanted to go. Yep. Exit right here at Delta, very smooth. Same height, just walking pace over to... Then you tell Watsonville traffic that you're clear 2-0 at Delta, when you, when you clear it. Watsonville traffic, helicopter, 0, zero hotel. Clear 2-0 at Delta, Watsonville. Just want to clear it. Still on runway two zero, so okay. this is clear. <laughs> All right. All right, people. It's time for some quick stops. So why don't you taxi me? Follow this jet. See him? Big one. Don't get too close to him because he could have some blowback. Not really a jet, but anyway. Center line and walk. Walk down. Don't run because you might get too close to him. We'll walk. We'll do some quick stops into the wind. All right. Don't be strong. There is some weather yonder, and that means up and down drafts. So there could be a little light turbulence around here.
Cross runway 927 at Watsonville, Blue and White King Air. General, these guys are working, so don't hang around here. Good. Now this guy probably just going to take the runway because it's expensive for him to uh, hang around. This is a good taxi, although you're now creeping to the right because you love the right-hand side, right? Yeah. Now he's doing some run-ups. Big deal. And when you get to nine or two seven, you're going to hold short, of course. We'll spin around. Now we'll try some quick stops into the wind. Make sure your tail's clear. The maintenance guys aren't didn't leave anything right here. Pivot. Check the stock. So this is going to be good. It's going to be into the wind. Look like Wendy's going to fire up her aircraft. I want to do a, a quick stop shorter where those guys are doing maintenance, all right? So this is no air taxi. This is just you're going to be moving. And we'll count it down together. Okay. Act like we're going to take off. A little takeoff profile. All right. So like, okay, okay, green. Carpet's good. So start walking slow. And walk a little faster. Center line. Look long. No aggressive maneuver. There we go. And ready, three, two, one. Easy, down, right, aft. A little more aft to stop, more aft. There you go, lift, level, left pedal. That was not bad, that was better. not bad. We stopped short of these guys. Okay, we're gonna do two more. So let's go a little past, lights right. are out, green, box. Get control. Watsonville traffic, uh, Gamma Jet 889 is Blue and White King Air taking runway 20 for Watsonville. Walk a little Ford faster. Departure. Gamma Jet 889 be a left crosswind departure. All right. Don't hit the tail. Gentle. Three, two, one. Easy does it. Down right, more aft. I want more aft. Hit the brakes. That's, that, I could have used a little more aft. You're going to see a jet go by or a <laughs> twin. Yeah. All right, we're together on this, all right? All I'm right. going to demonstrate. So be a little light so I can have the controls. Okay. So I'm going to just walk a little bit. i got to get control first. Walk a little faster. Run a little bit. And run faster. Now we're going to stop down here. I'm going to crab it a little bit because of the wind. Three, two, one. I go slowly. So I know what I'm doing. I'm not climbing or descending. Here's my good high nose stop. Lift, level, walk it down with pedals traffic, five uh, feet. King Air 250 yeah. still on the runway, runway two. So that was a good stop. You were kind of sliding, and I want more of a stop, but not like this. It's yeah. a stop as you're walking it down. All right, let's take a pedal turn to see what this uh, twin's doing. You have control? I got it. All right. Let's take a peek at the big boy on the runway. There he is. Well, he's called it, so we're going to not take off and play ball with him on the upwind, right? Yeah. We're going to let him go. So why don't you just watch him oh, as you're... What's your first uh, tour? It's still unknown. I'm going to have to talk to Taylor on that, but I believe they're going to come in at 1.30. Okay, up. Thanks. All right, we'll just look at him. See how smooth you are when you're distracted watching yeah. that guy? That's how you want to fly, distracted, <laughs> but mellow. So he's sitting on a runway, which is dangerous. He should be on the go. So he maybe he's waiting for a IFR clearance. He should have done that on the taxiway. Keep walking a little bit. And we'll watch him take off. My car beats about halfway, I think, and That's still right. feels like I'm pulling a lot of power here. Okay, we'll go down. Um, stay in ground effect. And don't lose your lift, because think of the lift as a big bowl of water, and you don't want to slosh it. Yeah. You might feel some ground, I mean, some uh, turbulence from him, wake turbulence. Say, hey, look, if you're stable, you don't yank a bunch, but if you're a wonky, same thing. You'll be you'll pulling more power to try to maintain that. So 
Don't you come to a little mini stop. There you go. So this time you're going to do a, a, another left traffic pattern, but your spot is the run-up area where that uh, twin engine just started. Uh -huh. Not the runway, but the run-up if there's nobody else around. Okay. You're going to do an approach to the run-up. So spin around, take off, all right? Lights are out. Green, green, green. That guy's already gone, so that's what he was doing. Okay. Instrument. Traffic helicopter zero zero hotel on the go taxiway parallel two zero left traffic Watsonville. Very good. So wait for it. Channel very nice. I ball your trim because that'll help everybody. Now you're looking for numbers and there they are. Very nice. Now it's done. Cover a little. Remember that school. Remember the departure end is the danger zone, so you don't want to kind of. Lean over here. Yeah, Watsonville traffic, uh, Blue White King Air is uh, six miles to the south, uh, burning your airspace. We're level at four, Camp Jet 889. See you later. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero zero hotel, left crosswind two zero, Watsonville. You're getting this, man. This is good. Remember the school? Let's go wide of it. You already have the spot picked, the run up area. Starting to rain over here, here, here. Start, starting to kind of come closer. Now you've, you've been long on all your spots, so I want your base turn to start working your numbers. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel, left downwind two zero, Watsonville. I think you're pulling too much power there on final when you need to be down here and sit nap. All right, the 44 is spinning, so I don't know what she's going to do, but you're going to go to the run-up area of 2-0. All okay. you say is alpha. You know, you don't have to say the run-up or nothing. Alpha. alpha. Just alpha taxiway parallel 2-0, you know, the usual. Yeah. So it's just, it, alpha's very, way on the end there, right? The whole thing is alpha. The whole thing is alpha. Yeah. The taxiway. Taxiway alpha. So what's the point we're targeting? The, the beginning of runway 2-0 where that... The twin engine was warming up. The holding area. Correct. Okay. So, midfield checks, what do you do? About three. There you go. Be full bird wet. Little hawk there. Now you're going to turn base and you're going to get your numbers where you want them right yeah. now or early so you don't hassle. Right. we got to hit that spot. Power. Power setting attitude. As you turn, you go look at it and go get it. Watsonville traffic, helicopter, zero, zero, hotel, left base, two, zero, Watsonville. All right, you should have it all figured out by now. Nobody coming in and out. So, taxiway Alpha, two, zero. Yeah. Right. Uh, you know, final taxiway Alpha. So what? Watsonville traffic, helicopter, zero, zero, hotel, final taxiway Alpha. Zero. Okay, you're looking great. A little aft, walk me up there. Don't hit one of those trees. Power. This is looking perfect, but don't trim a tree. So stay a little up, down, right, level. Good. Now this is kind of a run, so it's slowly, without me feeling it, slow me down to a walk. A little more nose up, a little more 15, and out. Down, right, out. That's it. Perfect. Now blend the power back in so you keep this rate going all the way to five feet. Not too soon. Just as fast as this. Perfect. Heading with pedals. You're looking for five feet. All right, Eddie, that's how you do it. Don't lose it at the bottom. So you don't need to yank. You want to just use your ground effect as you get down there. 
Very good. All right, take a peek at, uh, let's do a little pedal turn so we're not, no one's coming in behind us. Okay. Get me down a little bit five feet. This is like six, seven feet. And let's look around. We've got one helicopter. We've got Coming rain. Watch the traffic helicopter, 1AQ on the go, Alpha Taxi, parallel 20, straight as far as you want to go. Here we got her. No factor. Now, today, because of the overcast, some aircraft's going to come in runway 2, so we got to be extra careful they're not coming in at us. All right? All right, look at 9 or 2-7. Make sure no one's taking off on it, because you're smart, right? Look over here. It's all clear. So we're going to do some more quick stops, all right? Okay. So there goes Windy. So let's just kind of get on the go, walking slow, walking fast, get control first. Great. Remember, you're not pushing and shoving, you're just gentle. All right, relax and ready. Three, two, one, go. Down, right, aft, or aft. Pick that nose up, higher. No, you're sinking. Forward, five feet. I think you can really hit the brakes on some of these, because the wind's kind of calm. Okay, we're going to stop short of this uh, maintenance guy, all right? All right. Good. So we'll walk just a little, and we'll walk a little faster. Control, control. This might be a little quicker one, so don't be aggressive. Three, two, one. Easy does it. Down, right, aft. This is aft, like that. Yeah. Then lift, level. This is a walk. Down. Right. Five feet. I got to gain comfort on that aft. I'm just. That's all right. You got control. Got okay, let's go past this guy. We'll do another one. Lights are out. Green. Everybody's still good. Gentle. You don't dive into this. Here comes the transverse flow right about there. All right. You show me one. I'm just going to sit right. here. One. Down right. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Now recover gently. Lower right. than this. Gently Lower than this. Fun. That's yeah. how you do it, dude. All right. Then you wake everybody up at the bottom without yanking the heck out of it. Very good. That's a quick stop. All right. All right. All right. Yep. Not too high. Now you're out of ground effect, so start in ground. And you want to get control. Start walking slow, walking fast. And you show me another one on your terms. All right. Oh, well, you're kind of wonky here, so get control first. Look go. long. Check your trim. And then show me one. Three. One. Down, right, yeah. Yep. Now fix this. Lift, level. Left pedal. It's more little. There it is. And you have to crawl down. No hang around. Crawl down to five feet. There's no muscles needed, all right? I felt how smooth you were on that one you showed me. Well, I'm, I should be a little better, I guess. <laughs> All right, clear your tail. I don't want anybody right there. Pivot. And we're looking around for traffic. And you're going to let everybody know you're going to go Watsonville traffic helicopter 290 on the go, 20 or taxiway, whatever. Or left crosswind departure to the east. Okay? Right. If you're looking good. Right there. Are you? You're happy. Okay. Lights are out, green Good. screen, carpets okay. perf. Here we go. Watsonville traffic helicopter zero zero hotel on the go, taxiway parallel two zero to left crosswind departure, Watsonville. Don't dive into this. Control with a walking pace. There you go. Eyeball your trim. That's probably enough power. What about that guy? Okay, yeah. don't don't lean into the uh, danger zone of the runway. Lean over to the safe zone of the bottom bowl. Right. And we're going to go to the east. Go so climb rate. Climb attitude. Here we go. I'll go show you this pinnacle, all right? All right. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel. Left crosswind, departure to zero. Watch
All right, I'm not flying this little downdraft, so give me more uh, eastern heading or follow this road or whatever and climb. Check your numbers. Visibility's kind of poor, so don't let anybody sneak up on you here. Now in this little cell here and over here, there could be some downdrafts, updrafts, a little turbulence, so get ready. Good, 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 good. So the, the book say your stand from the left to the right, is that going to be for that, or is that just going to... Well, it doesn't matter, just as long as you have a good scan, and it's in 10 degree segments, up and down, and then move over another one, up and down, because the guy could be below you, up and down, up and down, but keep it lively. But don't fixate on a bird, you know, there's a bird, you know, because uh, there's eight birds right there, so you got to keep it lively. But give me more of an east heading, kind of this heading over here. Sometimes over the city, where are you going to go for an engine failure? Not, not in a lot of options. Maybe the high school, but there's kids. So maybe the field. You're in like a, a in a very foresty kind of area, or if you're over like a city, what are you looking for for failure? There's not many obvious landing spots. Yeah. Just have to go from engine out to engine out to engine out. But you, it drives you crazy after a while. But if you don't have options, then you're just kind of on your own. But if you have a nice field, you know, let's not fly over the foothills when we have a nice field type of thing. Yeah. But you don't always have that. So you just have to be smart, safe, and trust your engine. Way in the distance, you're going to see some green, bald, little ridge line way out there. Yeah. We're going to go, we're going to aim for that. Yeah. So instead of going this way, let's stay railroad track, safe zone, and then over to there. Uh, That's a pretty good altitude right here. Maybe a little higher. And the aircraft does come in from Salinas and Hollister, so you're literally sharp-eyed in here. Every now and then a call is kind of good. Are. Can't see anything on here. Seven Eight. miles, I guess. Six miles, whatever that is. Three miles. So three miles, four miles, five miles, and we're east because the airport's behind us. I know you're always somewhere here too. Three miles to. Three miles east, departing to the east at 1,005. Possible traffic helicopter zero Sarah Hotel. We're three miles east at 1,500, departing to the east, Baltimore. Baltimore traffic, location four, crossing runway 9027, or runway 20 on the ground. All right, there's a nice long, bald ridge over there that we're going to find a pinnacle. All right. We're going to do a high reconnaissance around it, thinking of that little acronym I drew on the board. Out, out to traffic land, Snyder 44, departing 20 Watsonville. So the power check we can do in route, there's many ways to do that. One of them is, uh, what am I pulling for straight and level 75? Pulling 20 inches. See that? Yep. Car beats right where it should be. So ground effect, you add a one inch, 21. Out of ground effect, you had two and it says 22. And the five minute rating for climb out, full three, so that's 23. And today we said 23.5. So we're kind of right on the cusp of uh, being legal. So that's your power check. There's another way to do it a 500 foot per minute climb. And I'll review that in the classroom. Just don't want to find out you can't do it at the site. All right, there's that ridge, so why don't you go get it? You can see these 
Loud bases are we're 1,004, and this is uh, maybe 1,900. We have to be 500 feet below that cloud because there could be instrument people in that cloud. Niner. So we got to be 500 below, which I think we are. I didn't bring my my tape measure, but <laughs> you know I could do that maybe and figure it out. All right, we're kind of out of Watsonville a little bit, Hollister, Salinas, so let's look for aircraft. But you're perfect heading for this little uh, bald ridge. We don't want any farmers with shotguns, marijuana growers with uh, shotguns, and no cattle to disturb. Usually your uh, the high recon, recon is uh, 500 feet above the site. So we might be a little need for a little bit higher if we don't booger that cloud. So we have to figure the wind out. So uh, see the smoke on this right here? There's a smoke indicator or a wind indicator. Looks like it's coming from uh, right to left. Yeah. Sometimes you'll catch a flag. Sometimes you'll catch uh, a water, or it would be glassy and then rough. Yeah. So you can see the wind going that way, maybe. So that's the wind. We've kind of figured out the wind direction coming off the ocean. Yeah. That saves us one of our our little acronym. It saves us a couple things. We already got the power check. We already have the wind. All right. Now we're looking for wires, so let's get established at our site. I see some towers there. Yeah. So you know there's some wires around the tower, so let's go find that ridge and go eyeball it. All right. Lights are out. Gauge is green. Carpet's good. It's good. See? It's not in the thing. So when it's in the thing, it's thing, huh? Yeah, we want to get it out of the, out of the arc. All right. Any intercraft doing what we're doing? There's, there's some cows low. Let's forget about the cows low. Let's look at the easiest and the highest top of okay. this little ridge line. See it? There's a little few cow, cow, cows here. Maybe not at the very top. So let's go eyeball it. Cows down. Yeah. And you're going to do a complete 360 circle around your spot that you pick. All right. Gone. There's I've those a, ones in the back that look clear. I've got a fence line here. I've got uh, power poles. I've got a tower. So we're looking for wires over your spot. Tower. Now, if the wind's coming here, you might get blown away here. Could be an updraft. It looks mostly clear, though. though. There's a bunch of cows over there. There's cows there and here, so maybe in between. So pick a spot in between. As I'm looking, I see a pole or a wire coming up the ridge. Yeah. Notice it? I see it? And also a fence line. So you pick a spot between the fence pole and the cows, right in the middle. So I do a full circle first? Yep, yep. you want to make sure it's clear. You're going in there. All right. So eyeball it, go around it. 60 knots and about 500 above it. So keep it in sight. Don't uh, lose sight of your spot because you're we're reconning it, right? Yep. So okay. any wires, is, uh, there's power lines here. See those power lines? Got the Are side. they any connecting? Look like here. No. Cows so, there. so if this is the wind, you have a softer bank here at your spot. Forget the cows, I don't want to bother them. Some landing zones down there if we had to. Okay, get your descent rate. Any obstructions? No, because there's no trees on the bridge, right? Yeah. A little fast, so down right level. I didn't feel any turbulence. I think you created that turbulence yourself. Yeah, cows down here, but yeah, right there it looks good. Force landing is to the left still, right? Yep. There's a power line right there, a little power. See? Yeah, it looks That's like it's coming uh, our direction right now. Good, but the, the, the spot itself looks good. Here's a steeper bank. Let's okay. do one more circle, all right? Because I want you to get the whole acronym out of the way. Power, power up. We did that. We did all that. Oh, oh, turbulence. Power, yeah. Now we're into forced landing right here probably, yeah. Now, how are you going to get in and out? Entry and exit. I'm going to come 
right here. Yeah, right traffic to the spot. Yep. Exit's right off the spot. You're not going to climb up to it because I don't want to hit this. So you're going to come down to it. Yep. All so right, we'll go good. right for that. And then the exit is right off the edge. Okay. Yeah, it was landing. Right. We're going to come to five feet. Our circle. Five foot hover. So let's make right traffic to the spot you picked. This will be crosswind, right? Yep. Right crosswind, right downwind, base and final. And you've got to use your numbers. Make it all mellow. Look around, look around, then come inside, 75, a little bit fast. You want to be really controlled. I would go down one over the houses, base, I'm walking right up to my spot. Okay. Lights are out, gauge is green. What about the car beat full? All right. Now you're not going to dive down here and try to climb up to it. You're going to come out here in space and find your angle out there. Don't turn too soon. As you turn base, you're looking for your angle. I don't want to be below or too high. So as you turn base out here, look at your spot. And then you have time to fix it. If you're too low or whatever. Okay, eyeball your spot. Go get it. I think you're going a little low. Maybe not. No? Yeah, I think you're perfect. No, I think you're all right because there's not a lot of wind. All right, walk up to your spot right now. Not too much power, you go too fast. Down, right, aft, boom, boom, boom. Want to walk. Power down. Watch your, watch your trip. And this is almost a run. I want to go a little slower because you're coming to a five foot hover on your spot. Yeah. I don't want to end up in the the bushes, I want to go to the precipice. Bring in your power, slow me down. Work, 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 work. There you go, now keep walking, don't stop. Keep walking, walk, you're dropping. Make it happen, yeah, good. Check your gauges. You almost pulled too much there. Now wake up your pedals. There's wonky wind here. I don't want to get spun around. Aim long in case you have to go around. Really got to wake up your pedals. See, look at your trim yeah. strings. It, the wind's right about there. But see, we're only pulling 21, 22 and a half, or 21 here. But see, uh, I think the trim helped me. See that? The yeah. wind is almost right there. All right, you have control? Got the control. That's a really tough maneuver, by the way, to yeah. do a good one. You have the control. I got the okay, control. here's your takeoff. You've already figured it out. Let's get on the go, look long, and this is all you need. Then you might have to crab. Don't dive down the ravine. Crab, so you're out of trim. Crab, here we go. That was all right. That was pretty good for your first little pinnacle. All right, mind if I get that to go? I'd rather do another one. I don't want to bother those people too much. <laughs> um, why don't we uh, head over this direction a little bit and find another one. All right. Remember this ridge line when you take your check ride. You can bring the examiner right here uh -huh. and show him a good one if he, if he wants you to do a pinnacle. All right. Okay, give me this heading right here. I'll go show you another one. Or you can pick one. All right. Let's keep in mind where the wind is. It was actually coming along the ridge when we got down final. So that's when you have to look at your trim and fix it. Because if you're over here, the wind could really walk you around, and then now you're out of control. Especially on a pinnacle. All right. Yeah, there's pinnacle uh, 12 o'clock that looks. Yeah, let's go grab one of those. Same thing. No cows, no farmers. In route, let's get a feel for the wind. Let's not do this, all right? <laughs> These guys wish they had a helicopter. In route, because the wind's different through these little canyons. The wind will be wrapping around. 
Let's see if we can get some smoke or dust or flags. So when you select a spot, make it easy, do a high recon, figure it out. All right. Wind and wires. What? W-O-T-F-E-E-L. What feel? Wind and wires, obstructions, turbulence, force landing, entry, exit, low recon. Now, if you're with the examiner and you're coming in way too fast and too hot, then it's called a low recon go around. Not a mistake. You just say, "This is my low recon, and it looks good. <laughs> it looks good. So let's go. Let's do it now." And All he'll right. go. He'll go. That's great. Even though you screwed it up, you're going to sell it to him. You know that you didn't. Yeah. Now, that's a little trailer park has a, a big flag on that white pole, but I don't see a flag, so. Let's see if we can find the wind. I'm assuming it's still this direction, or maybe like this. I don't know. Here's some really nice little soft spots up here. Make it easy and safe. Any aircraft coming through this gap because they do it all the time. Tight. So usually 500 above it, 500 AGL above some nice easy uh, pinnacle that's free of all kinds of stuff. And Target, this one's still above the clock here. All right. And 60 knot circle, and it's a perfect round circle so you can analyze it on your route. So however many circles it takes to get your, your uh, acronym figured out. Pinnacle here. Yeah. All right, everybody. Lights are out. Gauge is green. Carpet's looking good. To, uh, the little see. turb right there. Notice. Yeah. That wasn't you. So you're thinking about your 60 knot circle around something you pick. Yeah. So it's you should. On the there, right up here. All right. See a fence line. There. Fence line. Fence line. Got some construction workers here. I'm going to target this pinnacle right here. All right. Wind coming from here, if you like. Okay. And I'll probably make my approach uh, from the right. Well, let's eyeball the spot. I'm not quite sure which one you want. Is right there, here? Right here, okay. So slow me down about 60, 500 above it. Full right. carb. And we'll look at it. I don't want to go in there if there's any wires or whatever. Here. Fire. Right. Obstruction. There. Okay, we felt a little turbulence just to see if there's any quadrant that's going to have an updraft. So I want to per uh, circle around it. Out back here. No really obstructions. Now, forced landing might have to be this bridge itself, right? Yeah. Right in this little area here, forced landing. Not yeah. the not the canyon. All right, entry and exit. Real safe. The entry is going to be, I think, from right over about here. All right, and exit into the wind. Yeah. We have that kind of canyon there to kind of Good. altitude into. Good. Let's uh, yes. let's make right traffic to your spot. Right crosswind, right downwind. Base and final. Now let's pretend your buddy's down there, he had a, a car accident, whatever, he broke his leg, you got to go down there and pick him up, yep. you don't want to crash to save him. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going for this light green spot right there. All right. The lights are out green, full car, let's get our angle somewhere way out here in space. Now walk up to your buddy who's laying there with a broken leg, alright? Alright. Don't run up there and chop him up. course, if you don't like it, you miscalculated something, you go around. Now right here, you've got to find your angle early so you don't hassle. Find your, uh, your power setting, then you walk up there. Work, 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 work. 
Don't climb, don't descend. Just really make it happen. The slower, the better. Now, if you look at your spot, you're going to go too fast. So you've got to look up, down, right, aft. Now, ride this little cushion all the way to your spot. Not short. Yeah. Aim for the precipice. I just like to say that word. Now, you know you need your power in because you're slow. Otherwise, yeah. you'll settle in your downwash. So, just like you're doing. RPM is in the green. This is called a low recon. A little high, but not bad. Aim for the edge. Aim for the edge. This is not the edge. Just keep walking. Keep walking. Yeah. There we go. Now look at your trim. You're a little bit from the right, so give me a right pedal. Come to a five foot hover. Look long for level. So it's a little funky here. Yeah. But maybe here would be maybe we could put put it down right here. We're not, but we could. Yeah. So that was a nicer approach, dude. Okay, check your gauges, because we're only five feet. We can land yeah. right now. If you're happy, then we're, here we go. Look long and here we go. Here's where you use your trim so you don't get busted around. Good. A little bit of left, right pedal, and there you go. Look at sitting down, laying down right there. One, two, three, little deer. They're just taking a break. Like, uh, back here. Very nice. That that actually is very difficult to do, and you did a uh, really good job, so you feel good about it. Yeah, that one felt good. Felt like I was creeping in the end there, but all right, right? Going slow, yeah, adjust. Yeah, but you have to walk up. You have to creep up there, but keep it ball rolling to the edge. Because what if you're pulling red line? You're going to drop like a rock, nowhere to go. Yeah. But if you go to the edge and you're dropping like a rock, you just lean forward, and here we go. We're out. All right, let's kind of come back right through here and back through the valley, all right? Just know these hills pretty well by now, huh? Yeah. I've actually walked in here, too. Hiked all around them. Wow. But I'm an old guy. You know, I've done a few things. I've done a couple of things. If it was windy, you'd get a blast of air coming right up right here. Let's kind of ride this uh, little updraft, if there is in one, as we head back in. So I get a little... Okay, I have control. Uh oh. Bless you. Are you you're back? Do you have the controls? Now, I know there's some power lines coming up. So find a tower, go over the top, all right? You all have right. control. Clock, I see a tower there. All right. See, that's that turbulence right in this little cavity that you get a little bit of air. So just stay level. If, if it's way too bumpy, then you back it off a little to 65, you know. Tower, I'll fly right up. Engine failure right this second, you're going to go uh, in a big mess over here. So, you know, kind of plan your route so you can have a spot to go if we have a problem. So how far, how far to the east are you? Seven miles. Seven miles east at whatever we're at. And we're in, inbound for landing, Watsonville, yeah. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel. Seven miles to the east at 1,100 feet, inbound for landing, Watsonville. Okay, we got power lines, power lines, power lines, but I don't see anything in between. I don't want to hit a wire. You got to pick a pole. There you go. Don't go right over the top because you might catch your skid in it. You want to go high over the top. The guy's looking at you. Much beef back here. Oh. Why don't you flip up when you cross and you're safe and 
and comfortable. Flip up comp two and we'll get a recap on the weather, or the wind, all right? See all what right. runway we want. But this is your main concern. See the top wires are invisible. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. Here you can just sort of listen to the weather, see what's up. Watsonville Municipal Airport, Watsonville, California. Automated weather observation, one niner, one one, Zulu. Wind two, three, zero, at zero, seven. Visibility, one, zero. Sky condition, overcast, two, thousand. Temperature, one, six, Celsius. Dew point, one, two, Celsius. Altimeter, three, zero, one, seven. Remarks, density altitude, one hundred. Watsonville. So two three zero at seven. So what runway should we use? That was bad radio. So we'll use two zero, of course, right? How's your gauges look? Car beat, how's all that look? Looks pretty bad, huh? Yeah. How's your scan doing? That's a bad scan. I pulled a circuit breaker on you and uh, <laughs> you didn't catch it. That's a bad scan. So I'm going to have to slap your wrist, all right? <laughs> That's my heart attack there. <laughs> shame, shame. I know. I, well, don't let me do that to you. But, yeah. but you've got to have a better scan than that because that was quite a few, uh, uh, quite a bit of time went yeah. by and you didn't notice something that could have been, uh, been you know, getting worse and worse and worse, and you were not ready for it. How long did you have it out for? About a minute. Oh. Okay, okay. you got to be every 15 seconds take a peek at something. I think we should go uh, straight in auto, all right, if there's not too much traffic. Straight in. Uh, auto rotation, straight into taxiway parallel 20. So come out here by the by the lake as your base leg, and climb up a little higher. We can't go too high because of this cloud. Now we're going to do, have you done many autos with me or with Brian? Uh, done two. That's about the end I've done. Well, we got to keep doing them until... Matter 4-4 four, four left crosswind, two zero on the The only problem with uh, doing them on a Saturday is it's busy here. And we're, they don't know what we're doing. We're kind of high. So, it's a little sketchy to do them uh, at Watsonville. Well, we like to go to other airports. But I might have to assist a little bit on the first one, just so you're comfortable. But you want to be inside to interpret. So we're, what we're going to do is enter, like a robot. Three, two, one, we're going to enter. Down, 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 down collective, off. right pedal, simultaneous. And find level outside. Then we're going to separate the needles. Just with a little nudge. Traffic lamp, matter four, four, left downwind, two, zero, one, zero. Just with a little crack. Yeah. Okay, somebody just called left downwind, so we're going to be playing ball with him. I got him in sight. All right. So we'll keep an eyeball. We are, what? Three mile. Three mile left base at 1,000, whatever. Central traffic, helicopter 428 kilos, inbound localizer, zero, two, short line, 1,500. I got the Lancer in sight. Plus that's the helicopter. Somebody said downwind. See, they won't be able to see us very well. Traffic lamp, matter four, four, midfield left downwind, two, zero, full stop, one. So. That's him. Stop. The helicopter don't have yet. So Watsonville traffic helicopter, two, nine, zero, zero, tell us uh, three mile left base, presently 1,400. I have the Lancer in sight and we'll follow you in. Watsonville? See, that's how you say it. Dude, they're not going to see us. He's not as, He's not as high as we are either. Let's do our pre-landing checks now. Get that out of the way. Lights are out. Green, car beat full. And we're getting light on fuel, but we still have good gas. Now, we can't see our base traffic at all. So let's go over to the Pinto Lake for, and then we'll turn final. if we can catch this Lance here in front of this stuff. Stay up here. Four, four, final two zero, full stop, one, 
Anybody over here? Where's the Lance Air? There he is. Watsonville traffic helicopter. 290 tower is approaching Pinto Lake at 1,500. Final for taxiway parallel 20 Alpha Watsonville. Got some birds up here. Kilos inbound localizer 0 2 1 mile final 0 2 and Watsonville. See the yes. birds? Yep. All right. Let's not hit a bird. We're going to go at taxiway Alpha and Charlie. Well, we're going to come in down that localizer and fly right over the field at 700 feet. We're dodging birds right now. Lots of seagulls off the departure into runway two. All right, let's get it together. All right. Yeah, the visibility is poor. He's coming in straight at us, but we're going to go Alpha and Charlie. Charlie's the first one just past 27. Yeah. So let's get our numbers in order, about 70-ish. You're on the controls. And when we think we can hit that spot, we're going to go. All right. So come on the controls. On the control cover 428 kilos, short final 0 2, or over by the field 700, make a right turn. Uh, helicopter 420, or 290 zeros, 1200 on final for taxiway Alpha parallel 20, Watsonville. Okay, one, minus 0 2. 700 feet. Gotcha in sight. We're going to do a right 360 for separation, port, or 290 CR tow. And we're going to go miss here, right there. All right, is clear right? right? I don't want to play ball with him. He's lower, and we're coming down, so let's not do that, all right? So you have the controls on a right 360 for separation. So you're going to do that. You have the control? I have the control. All right, good. Visibility is poor. Yeah, I didn't see it. I'm going to miss 02 Watsonville, and we're going to make a right turn out back to the control unit. Watsonville traffic helicopter 290 zero tail over Pinto Lake 1200 final taxiway Alpha parallel 20 Watsonville. I have the helicopter in sight. All right, good. No factor. Oh, there's a. We're going to use a runway. No taxiway because you know why? There's two aircraft on it. Yeah. All right, look at your trim strings. That's where we're going to end up. All right. So they're coming up to the runway now. See that? Yep. So the horizons your level are 65. Yep. So they're almost to the numbers right now. Ready? Yep. Okay. Let's be like a robot. Three, be on this one, two, right? one. Right. Go. go. Down right level. All right. Check it up. Crack it off. Separate the needle. Look at it. Good. Now come inside and see where 65 is. Or look at the ocean. That's level. Yeah. RPM is a little high, so you check it up a little bit. Helicopter on final two zero coming out of 1,000 feet. Wake up your stuff. Look at your numbers. Forget about the ground. Yeah. Ground will be there. Just sit here. Now right about here, we're going to think the collective up a little and do a quick stop right here. Now crack the throttle to 80. Look at it. That's a good quick stop. Now come level and wake everybody up. Level. Yeah. Power and pedal. And I want five feet. Gentle. Don't be strong. Gentle down to five feet. Good. Don't be strong. I sense muscles here. All right, what time is it? Two. Let's make right traffic. On the go, two zero right traffic, okay? All right. Look long and let's check your gauges and let's go. That's right. Okay. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, Sierra Hotel. On the go, two zero right traffic, Watsonville. Trim. Boom. Good. All right, we're going to go right traffic, and we're going to do another one, and then we're going to quit. Plus, I got some tours, I think. I'm not sure. First, we need an aircraft. That and yeah. All right, look for birds, because we have a bunch of them. Get control. You're too slow, and you don't have your numbers. Then we'll do a right traffic. That wasn't bad. That was pretty good. The flare level, not bad. Don't be strong. <laughs> the reason it did that, because you're out of trim. All right, let's make the right crosswind. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel. Right crosswind, two zero, Watsonville. 
How are you holding up? How's your time frame doing? Yeah. Because we're over an hour. I just don't want to take too much of your... Oh, no, I'm here for this. <laughs> All right, let's go down, right downwind, which is parallel. We'll try to dodge these uh, downpours. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel, right downwind two zero, Watsonville. And we'll climb up again like we just did. Did you see the, I want you to really uh, remember that right 360 for separation that we did safely. Yeah. So we weren't coming down while he was uh, at 700 going miss to his little instrument thing. So really keep that in mind. We could do that. Uh, it's getting kind of funky for our auto, but we'll try another one. This guy decided to bail. Let's level off and go around the lake. This is probably high enough. Or level. All right, lights are out. Are they? Green, green, yeah, green. Car beat full. And the go. spot. Did that guy leave? Taxi. All right, we're going to either go runway or taxiway, whatever. But not too soon, so around, you know, the beginning of the lake, base to final, and don't get mix it up over here. You want to sit in your chair, downright level. Check, and then you separate the needles. Then you come inside and clean it up. The ground is coming, guaranteed. All right, right base to final, boom. Watsonville traffic, helicopter zero, zero hotel, right base to final, two zero, Watsonville. All right, check your uh, spot because I don't want to land on anybody. Don't sit back when you're looking. Stay level. Yeah, it looks there. pretty good. Don't see anybody. Oh, well, we got full carp. Let's not descend anymore because I want to have some altitude for you to play with. So we'll come level. What are you going to aim for? What's your spot? Numbers? Yep. All right, I don't like the numbers, but we'll go the numbers. Do, so we're uh, just kind of waiting right now. Hey, Charlie. We'll do Charlie. All right. We're just waiting to come into that phase, which is coming up pretty quick. So look at the horizon. That's level. And are you ready? Let's count it down. Look at the horizon. Yep. Let's go like a robot. Three, two, one, go. Down, right, a little more down, a little more right, a little more aft. Check. Now separate the needle. Look at it. Boom. There we go. No muscles. Watch Five. for trends. If you're slow, lower and forward. Just to that spot. A little more forward, because that's 61. We're 65. So we're too slow here. Right little here. baby flare. Crack the throttle. Can't forget the crack. That's enough throttle. And then level. So you can, the throttle crack has just got to be a nudge. Nice. All right. To get control and a little more level. So let's uh, let's uh, walk up to. They were lighter weight, so uh, without all that glide, you're slow, you're sinking. So we have to uh, we have to have that 65 knots, otherwise you just drop. Why don't we walk up and uh, we'll call it because uh, we're out of fuel. Almost. What about nine or two seven? Did you look at it? A little quick stop. Make sure it's clear, of course, because you're smart. All right, here we go. Uh, it's going to take a lot of autos to get comfortable. So don't worry about it. We'll just keep doing them and doing them. The throttle adjustment is, you know, you can't muscle that throttle because then you'll overspeed the whole system. So you just have to get let the governor do it for you. So you just crack it. We'll practice that a lot more so you get more comfortable. What's Ryan up to? Let's look at Ryan, all right? What's he up to? So we don't want to be cavalier, do we? I just wanted to say cavalier. You got control? I got a control. All right. Hospital traffic, Cessna 05 November, call the COR uh, Alpha approach. Now you know the spot we picked up from. That's where you're going back to, so don't run up there. Just walk up there, safe. Maybe on the asphalt because they cut the grass. Come over your spot, and we'll put it down. So I'd stay on the asphalt, come right over the spot, and center it up. 
up and put me down. All right. Where's your muscles? I don't like to see muscles, and I don't want to be five feet. Don't overfly anything you don't like or trust. I get over the spot and then pivot the heading. Don't put your tail in the hardware. And you're moving around here pretty quick. I want yeah. just controlled, mellow. Tail, watch your tail. You can get directly over the spot and do your pedal turn. All right. No muscle, just gentle fingertip control. Now you got to look at something to hold stable. Now we have plenty of gas, but I don't want to run out in this <laughs> trying to land. So this little stripe right here can kind of help you with your heading. That is you being too strong. Yeah. Watch my traffic. Cessna 9305, November VFR, uh, IFR 2400, inbound on the VOR. You're, you're trying to create a little baby trend. You're not actually trying to land, you're just trying to hover. And then hover lower. Hover a little lower. And hover just uh, one foot, half a foot. show you a little trick, all right? All right. All right. Tail's clear, clear behind. So I wanted asphalt, but you can cheat a little bit because this grass is not not cut too badly. Now there's my spot. The wind is not too bad. So I'm going to get stable here, and I'm just going to breathe it down as I'm, I'm crawling like a baby forward. Yeah. Looking at that truck, crawling like a baby forward. Is that you or me? And then you come all the way down, and just work, 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 and then you touch the ground. So let's let you try it. I'm going to back it up a little bit. We're not running it on the ground, but you're 